One useful feature of Microsoft Teams is that you can edit Teams files directly in the app. I'm on the Files tab of this team, which shows all of the shared files. To edit a file, you can click on the ellipsis icon on the right and choose your desired editing option. For this video, we're going to choose Edit in Teams. This will bring up the file in the same online editor we're used to seeing with SharePoint files. And you can see we have all the familiar tools and options. One of the benefits of editing a file in Teams is that any conversation you have stays connected to the file. We can open a chat for this document by choosing Start Conversation. This chat window is specific to this document and perpetual, so if I leave a comment here, anyone who opens the document anytime in the future will be able to see it. If we're editing this in Teams and we decide we need to use the full version of Word, I can just hit the ellipsis icon and choose Edit in Word. If we choose to edit in Word Online, the document will open a browser just like it would open directly from SharePoint. Though, if we edit in a place other than Teams, we will no longer be able to use the conversation functionality. Teams also goes one step further and lets you edit files while you're in a meeting, so you and your team can communicate while you're editing the document together. I'm going to join this meeting to demonstrate this. If you attached a file when you created your meeting, it will appear in the meeting chat window. If you want to share a new file, hit the attachment icon at the bottom and choose Browse Teams and Channels. Find the file you're looking for and click Share a Link. Now everyone in the meeting can see the link to the file and open it just by clicking on it. Then I can edit the file by choosing Edit and then Edit in Teams. You can tell from my status that I am still in the meeting. If anybody else was in this meeting with me, we would still be able to hear each other while we work on this document together. Though, it is worth noting that me pulling up this document does not open it for other attendees. They will have to click on the document themselves. When you're done editing, you can hit close on the upper right. And you'll be taken back to the meeting window. That's how you edit files directly in Microsoft Teams.